Hello, my it's Toycat, and this is some infected gameplay on lockdown from the new, uh, in new, wait, like the new, new infected playlist because they've um, updated the infected playlist. I think the update came out on Monday. They've gone rid of some of the more redundant modes and they've removed the throwing knives from the zombies, which makes it a lot more. Uh, they've also made it possible to mob. I'm not sure if you could before, but I didn't see any before, and now I've been seeing. I've been seeing like three or four every night, which is uh. You know, it it shows how common they are. Let me just get this one clear. I don't think a Moab in uh, Infected is, impre is impressive. I think it has the same sort of, um, what's the word, uh, achievement related to it as a um, Nuke Warfare 2. I mean, sure, you did something impressive, but it's it's nowhere near what it means. Uh, like, check out my Type 95 Moab. I think that means a lot more than that, even if it was with a uh, newbie gun. But um, now I've got that out of the way, I wanted to give some tips on how to, pl how to play uh, Infected and how to do well at Infected and how to get a mob in Infected because some people really want a mob and this is their only way to do it because I, I, I can appreciate getting a mob in online is hard, even I can barely do it. Uh, I've, I've had a lot of 20 something gun streaks but I haven't really had that many mobs in online so you know, so it's a good way to get mobs for people like that don't really know how online. So first of all what you want to do is you want to but based on the map, you want to balance where you're camping or where you're running around because uh, you also have to balance that based on how many players there is. Because being in a place like this is great if there's like eight zombies or so, but as you can see, there's a like they just start growing. The number of zombies grows as they get in slowly, and um, it gets crazy. And you need to know when to get out and how to get out. Uh, another little tip is the zombies have some form of dead silence and they have some form of lightweight, meaning they can run behind you and knife you and you will have no idea they're there because they're just they're just silent for no reason. Uh, another tip is a uh, quad feed the striker is know when to leave your camping location and always have a way out. Like if if you want to camp it for a bit, which is one of the smarter ways to play infected, I'll say. Uh, if you're gonna camp it, you need to know when to leave. Also quad quad clutch of the uh, five sevens that was just. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> um, I'm, I'm coming on 22 here. Two more kills, and then I get the mob, I believe. But um, if you w if you're gonna if you're gonna be um, running around, you need to you know watch all your back, watch your back, watch all your corners, all that sort of thing. Uh, here's the mob. I call it in. I'm sure if this was a short video, but thanks for watching. Uh, this was some infected gameplay. It's new. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more. Um, and yeah, goodbye and. Boom, at plus 1800. I'm not sure how many kills that was, but that was a crazy, crazy kill feed. Um, thanks for watching. This didn't mean that much, but, you know, as I've said before, it means something or other. And goodbye.